In this video, we'll review using saved searches. ProjectWise allows you to create your own saved searches. These saved searches are specific to each user and can only be modified by the user who created the search. When a saved search is selected, right-clicking opens options that are available specifically for saved searches. These same searches are available when you select the global or personal search folders. Once you've created a saved search, simply select the interface and then click on the saved search you wish to run and the search will run automatically. As the contents and properties of your work areas, folders, or documents are updated and modified, the same holds true for your search results. You can refresh existing search results either because you have modified the search criteria or you have redefined which users have been added since the original search was run. Simply right-click on the saved search and select Refresh. You can also create additional saved search folders under the Global and Personal Saved Search folders and then create and save new searches to those folders. If you want to rename your saved search folder, right-click on the folder and choose Properties. Then enter the desired name and click OK. If you wish to open a saved search from the Opened Advanced Search dialog, start by selecting the desired saved search, right-click, and select Show in Document Search. Click on Document Search to open the Search by Form. Here you can modify your search by adding any new criteria and then hit Apply. Once the search has been run, you'll be prompted to save the new search criteria if you wish to do so. Click Yes or No based on your future needs for this search. So, how do you create a saved search? The process is simple. Start by clicking on the search icon, and here we'll select Document Search to open the search by form. Enter your desired search criteria. Here, we'll search for all MicroStation documents with the default workflow in every environment. Click Apply to run the search. To save the search, click the Save Search drop-down and choose Save As. You can choose whether to save under the Global or Personal folder. If you'd like to save the search in another work area, click on Browse and navigate to the work area where you want to save the search. Name the new search and click Save. Here we see the new Save Search. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.